Hello, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do a little shop my stash for the month of February. And this is something I do every month, but I said I'd do something a little bit different. I decided I'm going to show you what I put in my little um, organizer thing, my monthly basket um, for last month. And then we're going to go to my Alex Stein drawers and shop some products and everything. So yeah, I decided that... For February, with the Valentine theme and all that, I want to get some Valentine Day. I'm going to do a Valentine look also. So, yeah, I decided to pick one of each category. I have a lot of Project Pants that I'm doing and trying to get through and all that. So, everything that I have on my face will be down below the description box and all that. But let's go ahead and I'll show you what I had in my basket for last month. So, let's go ahead and do with... How we start our face. So let's do primer. So the only primer I really had was the um, Filt Fenty Beauty No Instant Retouch Primer. I really do like this. It's great for only skin. Everything has a little pump. I really didn't use this that much and all that again because I do test out a lot of primers. I do do first impressions. You know, I do get things that. You know, I'm trying out, but still trying to use what's in my collection also. But, didn't do that. I do like that primer, but fortunately, yeah. And then for foundation, we have the Fenty Beauty. Also, the Pro Soft Matte one. This is really good. This is in 185. So, yeah. Um... I need to get more use out of this. I'm probably just going to keep the two ones in here because I need to get more use out of them. So I do have a primer I'm testing out. Then I need to go back and forth in other primers. So I'm probably going to keep this in at least for one month and all that since we're starting to get into somewhat warm weather. Right now it's kind of cold and all that. So I'm going to keep these two in. Um, I am going to keep my glam light i just recently got this it has a blush i mean two a bronzer and two highlights i've used these this one and that one i just haven't used a dark one but i'm going to keep this in it's supposed to be like the s'more palette and everything but i'm going to keep this in at least for one more month to do you know final review and everything when i do my likes and not like and all that but i am going to put back the um one more pro matte one. This I love so much. And you can see I almost got the embossment out. But this is something I love. I usually use this more during spring and summer again because my face is more oily and things like that. Um, I am going to put back the cream bronzer Fenty. I need to use my other bronzer so I'm probably going to get one cream and one non-cream. For uh, like the bronzer highlight and all that. Um, I have two matte bronzers. One is from the Essence Matte One. Very beautiful. But I'm going to put that back. Also going to put back the Hannah Hallow. This bronzer. I cannot say the name but. That's what it look like. Um, also going to put back two highlights. One for Wonder Beauty. This is in Afterglow. Very pretty. I've used this quite a bit. And the ColourPop Superstock Cheek in Flexitarian. Again, very beautiful one. Try to make sure it's ain't too long. Um, another foundation I'm putting back is the CoverGirl Olay. I've used quite a bit. You see there is a window right here. So I do like it. But I want to try, you know, since I've already got this one, I don't think I'm only going to pick out any foundations or any primers whatsoever. I do have a concealer. This one I'm going to keep in only because I've been trying to get use out of this. It still has the same window as it did before, but I'm going to keep that in. I'm trying to 
done with the ones. Another highlight I'm kind of going to keep in. Again, I have this in the corner of my eye. And this is like the Pixie one in cream gold. I just recently got this. Really beautiful. Really sparkly. But I am going to at least keep that in. So that would be one highlight I'm keeping in. This, the trio one, I'm not really excited to be a highlight bronzer. I'm just going to, you know, it's pretty much going to stay as like a face palette. So, um, but I am going to take back the cream, um, called Wet Blush. This is from Sophie in Maybelline in Bubbly. Very cool texture. It's like a bouncy, but it does feel like powdery and all that. So it feels creamy, but when you blend it, it turns to powder, which is really awesome. So play that back. Also, putting putting back the um age rewind. This and this is actually in medium because this the NARS one I use around my nose and all that because it's a little too deep for me, so I can't necessarily use it underneath my eyes. To brighten up and all that. So yeah. Um, putting back the spray. Which is the e.l.f. matte one. Matte magic one. That's going back. This highlighter. I'm actually going to declutter. This is like the Tarte um, Shape Tape Glow Wand. It's a little too deep. And it's in Dream. Even for like a highlight. Normal highlight. Still a little too deep. I'm actually going to be decluttering this. So that's going to be in the declutter. Putting back the Complete Culture Face, I mean powder in Claritin. Very beautiful, just a normal powder. So I have a whole bunch of powders I could go through and rotate and all of that. So I don't need to take a hold of that one. Um, eyebrow pencil clear one by Benefit. I really do like this, but again, I have other clear eyebrows that I need to go through. So, put that back. Um, I keep all my mascaras, everything. So, you'll see the same for mascara, prim eye primer, liner, L, I mean, gel liner, things like that. I keep still, I keep that the same because I don't want to open up too many mascaras or too many gel liners or anything like that. So that you'll see the same. Line eye primer, still the same. Still keeping it in. And then we have, oh, and I'm going to put back the Sephora crayon one eyebrow pencil. And then I have a whole bunch of lip and eye product single shadows. So I'm going to put back both the Essence Multi Chrome one, one in Steal the Look and Platinum Night. So I'm going to put both of these back along with this one by She Glam. Dance for me. This. I might end up cluttering because it's really not as, I don't know, looks beautiful. So I'm going to keep it, but I'm going to put it back and everything. Also, the Tarte one by Fire Dancer, really beautiful one. So what it look like. Play that back. And that, oh. And this one by Black Radiant in Star Study. I have this on my eyes, but I have it underneath a actual shadow and a palette. So yeah. Oh, I am gonna put back my Boeing Benefit Cilla, one of my favorite ones, but I need to work on the ones I have and need to somewhat get through. Okay, so before we do that, let's go ahead and talk about eyeshadow palettes. Um, I'm going to put back, actually I'm going to keep the Sheer Planet one. I have one of the colors in my um, Crete and my eyes. I have Andalance Avalanche, which is beautiful uh, sky blue over the single shadow, or uh, the single glam shadow. I have Cub 
in the crease. So I am going to keep that. Probably pick out more like more pinky type tones for Valentine's since this is the moth. Um, I'm going to put back the Ace Beauty. I actually want to keep this because this is actually a cool. Got really good colors for Valentine. Got the pinks, the purples, and all that. And I haven't used this yet. So I need to get more use out of it and I need to use it. So that's the only two palettes I'm going to keep out for now. But I am going to put back my Rose Court. Actually, I'm probably going to do a little review. Well, actually, I did my likes and not like, but I love it. Beautiful, but I've used it plenty of times. Again, it would be great for Valentine's Day, but still, I have to... So, I'm going to put this back for now, along with LA Pro. Again, beautiful for Valentine, but... I want to use more looks. Then the Warrior, the Warrior 2 by Juvia's, which is all matte. So I'm going to put that back. Now for lips, this one right here, which I have all my um, lips along with the MAC lipstick in Hey Frenchie. That was on my lips today. Um, I'm going to put that back. But I'm going to keep this, because this I recently got too by Mellow, and I want to keep trying that. I am going to put the Flower Bomb Liquid Blush by Flower Beauty back. I'm going to keep the Wear Beauty Lip Balm in Honor. This is actually something I'm actually going to probably put in my purse, because I need to get rid of one of the um, lip balms I have, because I don't like the way it feels. Um, I'm probably going to keep the Speak Love Glossy Lip Treatment by LYS. Again, I just recently got this. This one, Summer Friday Lip Butter Balm. I'm going to put that back. I'm actually going to be clad the She Glam Butter Up Stick. Again, it just seems okay, but again, it don't feel like it does anything at all so this I'm actually going to be decluttering um pray back the Huda Beauty Silk Balm in Rose Quartz very beautiful but need to put that back um I'm going to keep the Huda Beauty Lip Contour in Honey Beige and I'm going to put the Buxom Vava Plump Beg for Mom back Along with the Kapai lip gloss and birthday suit and the Clinique Black Honey Lip Balm. Oh, lipstick. So that stuff I'm going to be putting back and all that too. I'm going to be decluttering. And then let's go ahead and pick some makeup from my Alex Stein drawer, shop my stash, and all that. So. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so you guys recognize this. This is my Alex 9 drawer and all that. So we have my foundation, concealers, and primers. So you guys know that I'm really not going to get another primer or foundation because I want to concentrate on those two. But I am going to get at least one concealer. And I think for concealer... Let's do the Tarte one right here. This is the Hydro. I think this is a little too deep for me too. Let me check. Yeah, it's a little too deep. Let's do another one that's not as deep. Um, actually, let's do Burn This Way. I haven't used this one, and this one is a little bit less. So, this is born this way and all that. So, go ahead and we'll do that one. So that's all we're going to pick. And then for the second one, we have all of my powders. 
So for powders, again, I'm just going to pick one because I have tons of powders that I need to work on. It's the only five powder I've used for quite a while. Um, let's do... Actually, let's do a old classic. Let's do the Peach Perfect Powder. Then down here we have all of my semi sprays. So I'm just gonna pick again one. And let's do Herb Decay. I haven't used that for a while. This is something that I really like and all that. So and down here we have all of my um bronzers. And let me go ahead and move the light down some. But these, they go work. I'm majorly gonna have to edit this stuff out. Because for some odd reason, it's not working. As I was saying, sorry for that. Um, these are all my bronzers. We have my YSL, which I do like a lot. Uh, let's see. I'm going to take this out and move this up. Um, let's see. I think I want to be kind of glowy, so I'm going to go ahead and do this one. The Skin Light. This is a beautiful like bronzer, especially for um, see that glow. I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. But that's the glow, and I figured, you know, I just want to be a little bronzy, little glow, and all that. Then we have this. All my bronzer, cream bronzers, are pretty much on my um, vanity where I get ready. So we'll get down there. So just give me a moment for that. But these are all of my bronzers. I mean my... Um, all of my blushes so since February is about pinks and purples and all that um let's see let's do that one it's pretty pinks and everything so those are the colors I'd be good and then let's do this one by cover yep let's do that one that got pinky and a glowy type thing so that would be perfect for Valentine's Day I know too much but it'll be fine and then for highlight Let's do Becca in Vanilla Court. That has like, I think, a little 
pink hues. Do that one, and then I have another one that is kind of got like a pink tone to it, which this is like Esther, because it has like a little pink shift, which personally I think would be like beautiful. But that is it for that one. And then... Let me go ahead and show you the um, palettes, which is way down here in these three drawers. So, head and show you palettes and everything. So we have these palettes right here, and let's see. Trying to find one got like purples and pinks and all that. I think. Got some purples like that one. Now let's do the B the I B Y. moment but this is IBY almost similar as the other one I almost got like the lily stain type of tune let me see yeah. we'll do this one we got that one, and then we have another drawer, which is down here. This is all my medium size palettes. And I don't think I want anything from here. We have enough purples and pinks and all of that. So let's go ahead and do like the smaller size. Oh, let's do this one. This one, my Viziat, actually called. That has like a few greens. Cute. So that's the color. So we'll do some of that one. Um I don't want to do red. I do have this one by the this one, but this has mostly a lot of purples and ow, all that. So Plus, I have not purples, but they got violets and all that. But these are like the colors right here. Eh, I'll do that one. Let's see, with this one. No. So I think that's all I'm gonna be doing for palettes. I don't think I want any more palettes. Or anything like that. This one actually kind of cute. With this one, I use this for a while. Okay. That is all the palettes that I am putting in my drawer and all that. So let me go ahead and get these set up. And then you guys will show me. And I do fast forward all of this. Plus, I'm not picking any more lips out. Because these are lips for the month of February. So I do have plenty of lips to go through, get by, show, wear, and all that. So if I need any things to... Go along with it, I pick from here. So yeah. But that is everything. So let me go ahead and sh get everything over and show you my basket and put everything in. And I do fast for that part of the um, video and all that. So just give me one moment. Be right back. 
Okay, so here we are. Now I'm going to put everything back in these drawers so I keep all of my everyday makeup for the month and everything up here. Up there, right there, is all my glosses I'm trying to get through for the month of 2000, for the year of 2022. So, go ahead and put everything in. Everything I put in, and then over here is where I keep all of my palettes. So, yeah. But that's everything for my monthly makeup stash and all that for month of... February. So, hope you guys like the video. Hope you have a wonderful day and night. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and a hit the notification bell. That way you guys know when I upload every weekend and Wednesday. And everything, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and all that. And tell me if what makeup you picked out for a month. Or do you do a shop my stash for the month, every month? And pick out some type of makeup. Or do you just wear whatever you want and you don't do it? I would love to hear. Just Comment that down below and all that. And I will see you next time. Have a, don't forget, my name is Christina. And have a lovely day and night. I love you guys. Uh, till then, I'll see you next time. Bye.